All right, so I'm going to uh, work out a problem on related rates uh, involving spheres. Uh, here we have a balloon that's being deflated at a rate of negative five centimeters cubed per second. So since it says cubed, that means that's the volume. Now we need to find the rate that the surface area is decreasing at the instant the radius is six centimeters. So if we're trying to find the change in the radius, that means we're going to have to take the derivative, I mean the change in the surface area, sorry. We're going to have to take the derivative of the surface area formula of a sphere, which is four pi r squared. Now when we take the derivative of that, we get uh, dsa dt is equal to 8 pi r dr dt. Now we have a problem here because we don't know what dr dt is. So we're going to have to use the volume formula to figure that out. Since we're given a volume uh, value here, we can go ahead and find dr dt. So we'll go ahead and take the derivative of the formula for the volume of a sphere, and we get dv dt is equal to 4 pi r squared dr dt. So we already know a dv dt and uh, the radius, so Go ahead and plug in our values. We, we've got negative uh, 5 is equal to 4 pi uh, 6 squared dr dt. Go ahead and divide by 144 pi because that's what 4 times uh, 36 is. And we get dr dt is equal to negative 0 0.011 centimeters uh, per second. Now that we have dr dt, we can go back to the uh, surface area formula. And we already found the derivative up here, so I mean, we can rewrite it down here. But we've plugged in the value for the radius, which is 6, and dr dt, which is negative uh, 0 0.011. And then the, radi uh, the change in the surface area uh, with respect to time is equal to negative 1.659 centimeters squared. Remember that because we're talking about area per second.